Hello, welcome to today's I Only Scotland Heart to Heart. This week we are taking a walk through Jesus' daily activities as he walks through his week leading up to the cross. So today is Tuesday and once again Jesus is returning to the city from Bethany and on the way he passes the now withered fig tree and he takes that opportunity to teach on faith and to teach the disciples about faith. He then goes from there with the disciples into the temple which he had cleared yesterday and teaches the people. He is then challenged uh, by the Jewish elders who he challenges back and ends up confounding them. He moves on from the temple to the Mount of Olives where he teaches on the end time judgments that have still to come and his eventual return. And he summarises this teaching in Luke chapter 21 verse 36 where he says, Keep a constant eye and a constant watch over your soul and pray for the courage and grace to prevail over all these things that are destined to occur. And then you will stand before the presence of the Son of Man with a clear conscience. So Jesus teaches about his return even before he goes to the cross. And he warns us to be vigilant. He wants to remind us too that the crucifixion is not the end. So he's given us hope or he's given his disciples hope even before he dies. Jesus is also using these teachings to promote faith in us and to warn us not to be distracted by the world, to keep a short account, to keep pressing into him, not to allow anything that is less than truth permeate our lives, our actions, our thoughts and our soul. And he is warning that it wouldn't be easy because we we're living in a world that doesn't see or understand or receive his truth. And yet, if we do that, we will be able to share his truth to a world who so desperately needs the healing and the hope and the life eternal that Jesus promises. But it's not easy. And the only way that we do that is to spend time at Jesus' feet. But be encouraged. We have been living through some very difficult times over this past year. And this pandemic has claimed many lives, much more in some cases than even COVID-19 has. And yet Jesus says in John chapter 16 and verse 33, I have told you these things so that in me you may have peace. In this world, you will have trouble, but take heart, 
for I have overcome the world. So this week, just take time to come again and sit at his feet. Consider what he is teaching. Holy Week and the crucifixion, Easter ultimately is about hope, about victory, about good triumphing over evil. But there is much in the walk up to that that Jesus would have us contemplate and to have us take into our hearts and let it produce something good in us so that we become like him. So I encourage you just to take time to contemplate what God would say to you through what Jesus has done this week, this Tuesday, on his walk towards the cross in Calvary. Be blessed.